everyone welcome back to another video another weekly vlog another saturday vlog to be honest i started my saturday waking up pretty late because i was up playing games until unspeakable hours and i just had to get up get ready real fast and get out because it was my best friend's birthday and she invited me for lunch it was a lovely sushi place near the dodo river and every time we have to walk down that way the view is just amazing and we had great sushi it's one of my favorite places to go we actually got served by the cute robot cat this time it's the first time it happened to me at least in this particular restaurant after that we just walked near the dora river and it helps always with digestion walking a little bit before going home when we got home i did a little bit of cleaning around my work area it was clean for about one day and a half amazing progress and you know if it lasts more than a day great later that day we took my doggo a dog over there Pitel, and my sister's cat nix she's actually like over here you see that black thing here it's her <laughs> she looks so cute and uh, nix is now three months old i think and when we went to the vet this time she was all about exploring she would not stand still for a second that i just had some lazy dinner had my instant noodles was watching my netflix just relaxed for a bit and then i did meal prepping for pixel if you guys don't know my doggo eats food prepared by me so his vet is all about uh, when it, when he asked me what he eats i was like i, I cook for him I, i'm the one that does meal planning and meal prepping for him he was like, oh yeah, I can totally see why his fur is like so shiny and stuff. So, if, if you guys ever want me to make a video on what I cook for Pixel, let me know. Until then, you have here a short, speedy montage of me making food for Pixel. I just get some vegetables, some kind of meat, rice, and I mix everything. I put in containers and I freeze it. This batch is supposed to last for about 10 days. Sometimes I do enough for two or three weeks. It all depends on how much space we have in the freezer or how long I feel like cooking for. So the last thing I did was get my red dye and dye my hair. And I have a friend that thought that I was just always dye my hair black now but i actually always dye it red because i know it will only get on the root because that's where i get my whites so i feel like it does a nice effect here of like red and then black so that's that's my little experiment that i have been doing for the last couple of months and that is it for this week for next week's video we are going to the highest point of continental portugal so if you want to watch that don't forget to subscribe if you want to watch last week's vlog make sure you click over here thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys next week